Okay, here we go. Let's jump into this adventure. This time I'm playing with a joystick, a Microsoft controller. I'm trying to change it up a bit. On my mark, loose your arrow into the stone. It worked. We can now make our way back. Come. That stair was blocked. There's a white crystal ahead, just laying there. Maybe it'll help us get out of this stupid place. Watch the attitude, boy. <gasps> Still trying to feel this controller out. Man, it was so tough to play this game with uh, with the keyboard and the mouse. Uh, like I said, you dance with your fingers across the keyboard like a spider. Like you, not only the W A S D, but also the Q, the E, the R, the F, the Shift, the Control. Uh, I might be exaggerating <laughs> right now, but the, <laughs> most of those are definitely true. Uh, there's a lot of controls. It's it, this game is all made for the fighting mechanics, obviously, and it's a PlayStation game. So I thought, let's give my hand a rest. I don't like to. I don't like to sit there with a the keyboard and a mouse the whole time. Let's give my hands a rest and let's just lay back with the controller. But yeah, this is derpy as I get out. I have to turn this all over again. <laughs> uh, don't worry, I'm, I'm getting the hang of it. Man, I got aim. Yeah. Woo. You gotta aim that stuff. You gotta pull it out. It's not the same button as pulling it back in. I gotta get all those. Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting the hang of it. I think I need to line it up though. I see the other one behind there. Uh, what's right behind it? Jeez, okay. Just have to get a little bit closer here. Six hundred fifty three, okay, that's not bad. I feel like I usually always get like nothing. See, it's kind of wonky because you use the right, the right bumper and the right trigger to for punch. 
and character, or head to the strong head. Which which other game does that? Usually it's both triggers, and the bumpers do something else. Okay. It's it's but. Like I said before, it's it's amazingly well made this game. Really. It's made for the, the gaming mechanics and of course the story and everything, but really that's the cherry on the top here is the fighting mechanics. And they definitely reinvented the style of of fighting in a game. Cause if anybody tells you hit in the game, what do you think? You think square, right? On, on, the, on the PlayStation controller, square. Or Y on, on Xbox. Where's that switch? I, I, I got switched lately. Now that I have a kid, not that I wouldn't have gotten it anyway, but you know, it's the best uh, when you have a young kid to get Switch. Most appropriate games and stuff. I always grew up a Nintendo guy anyway, so. But ever since I got the Switch, the Switch, the Switch's controller is like the Xbox's controller in reverse. The Xbox and the PlayStation controllers are pretty similar in the layout, where you expect to press for menu, for hit, for jump, right? It tends to be the same. But Switch has the kind of the first, where jump and hit usually is in most games. Let's see here. Oh, this is a good one. Okay, so yeah, this I can uh, I can enhance my my uh, my gear with that kind of stuff. These enchantments and uh, upgrades to armor. And stuff. Like at this point, I got the hang of the whole building your character thing in this game. It really, it took a while to wrap my mind around. It's very different than Minecraft. Sorry, <laughs> I just finished playing Minecraft. I mean, Fallout. Very different than Fallout. And Elder Scrolls. The way you upgrade your character. It's very different than those games, but... But it's cool. It's cool. I got the hang of it now. That's all that matters. So I'm just thinking about doing some side quests today. I'll try to follow the the main quest a little bit. But I do want to level up a little bit more and get a feel for the world. So I'm going to do a little bit of uh, side questing. What's going on here? So that stuff growing around here in Alfheim is bad, right? My arrow can't get through all that stuff covering it. It's still yeah, covered. Exactly. I, have to... so I don't know what you think I can do here. Yeah, that's the problem when you have such an attitude that you, your kid gets that kind of attitude. You gotta slow your roll. Keep it cool. Nice catch. <laughs> I love all these little details in this game. There's, there's, uh, I mean, they paid attention to a lot of little details. 
Oh, these guys. On the bridge? Nah. I think, yeah. Just keep him on. You just, you just keep him there. Yeah, boy. Oh no, someone else is targeting me. <laughs> what about it? Yeah, really helpful to have the kid. Especially against these elves. Dark elves, I should say. Wait, is that blocking? It's... Oh. Yeah, I see it. Finally! I'll light the crystal if you find me an angle. <sighs> Let us make our way back up. Okay, so this is going to be a puzzle. I like that. I like that. Okay, so let's figure out how we get up there. There's the climb, but we're going to have to move those crystals around. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is shot. Oh, right stick, come on. Oh, yeah. Yes. That's how you do it. Getting the hang of this. Strike of the guard. What is that? Just give me a second. Let me just figure out. I want to get the best upgrade for my fighting style. Lots of stuff to upgrade, at least. Yeah, let's... I thought they were, those were upgraded. From before, but... So I can't... Stick my hand in the light yet. Alright, this time around. This is block two. Oh, okay. I could have ended up just not trying to jump there. I could so have happened. Yeah! I love it when I get them flying off the cliff. Okay, that didn't work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I see it now. Okay, I got it. Where are you taking that? Look here. Okay, it's gonna be it's reading time. Yeah, I can just put pause if you want to read this. I don't always keep it long enough open. Sometimes I do. Depends. Oh look! The blue door that's not a door. And a sand bowl. But how do you expect me to reach it? 
What does this mean? Seed. Remember the shape. That's yeah, I know. That's the logo that was in the water. That came out like sculptures in the water. I, I'm thinking it's the. Oh, what, what did she, he say? Life. I'm thinking it's the logo for the dark elves. Okay. Doesn't always go as you expect. doesn't seem to be a part of the puzzle right now. Gonna carry that everywhere? I just might. Now, now we can open this thing. Now that there's a bridge. If I want your opinion, boy, I will ask for it. Climb up. Have a look. I can't get to the bowl from here. It's too far to jump. Hold on. Not like I have a choice. <laughs> you can reach the bowl now. Uh-huh. Go ahead. Greatest man or tallest tree begins as any more than me. Yeah. And see, stupid rails. So, it's a door after all. He is surprisingly sweet for having such a father. I truly believe if you talk to your kid that way, he would not be sweet like that.
he gets angry when he sees his dad. Great. The one with the horns is back. What does he want now? Yeah, this is fun, dude. Let's just have a look. Light elves. Okay, so it's a little more complicated than it looks like on the, on the surface. Or is it? I hate that guy. He will be back. Nah, I don't know. No, the boat isn't here. It's still back at the other side of the lake. Then we go back the way we came. We really gotta go back down here again? Do you see any other way? No. Then? Just making sure that I got it all. Looks like that and behaves that way. I guess it would be kind of crazy too. <laughs> Having an elevator like that. I know. Great. Now I can barely see. There's light. Make do. Still getting a hang of the RB and it would help me if you would hold the light up so I could see where I'm shooting. Use your ears. Adapt. Okay, so there's all these strategies, various strategies to how to fight these uh, creatures. This was, this time it just updated with a new strategy. Uh, or a new insight into how this creature behaves. In any case, when you think about uh, Kratos in this game. How are we supposed to get across without a crystal? We find a crystal. And yeah, perfect example. His his, uh, his snappy at um, patience, his bitterness. Uh, I'm thinking it's supposed to reflect his uh, his grief for his wife who died. But the son is at total loss because, like, like he says here and there. Um, it has been repeated that he's, he's stuck with someone he doesn't want to be stuck with. He doesn't want to be stuck with his dad. He doesn't really like his dad. I'm sure he respects him, probably loves him, but he doesn't like him. And so he's, he feels like he's isolated on, him. on an island, you know. There's just a sense of isolation. Yeah, frozen. Or shatterer? Okay, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Freeze enemies and then shatter them. Right. 
Okay, so, but I gotta get a hang of that, because you... You don't just freeze them with a regular hit, do you? You have to... It's that special attack, isn't it? Or do they get freeze frozen by the blade anyway? Ah, man. What? Ooh. Have we made another scratch there? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> wow. And smash. Yeah. That's fun. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. This is such a dance game though. Man, this is this is what I play when family's asleep late at night. Dreaming myself away into this Viking realm. Obviously not what you're saying, but I just want to get them all. Fun to throw the axe. And you never know. Often when I get the, the, the level going, it's when I, I just try something out that doesn't seem obvious on, on the surface. You know? Like when I jumped over that pillar, it initially seemed like Oh, we're blocked, we can't get past them. But then he actually did jump, even though he never really jumps in the game. Yeah. It's, uh, so you just gotta experiment, you gotta try, try the various stuff out. Oh, what happened to her? What is this? Oh, that's the light out. Spoils of war? Ooh, a whole new, a whole new thing to collect. Nice, I like that. I like these uh, Norse collectibles. I like the attention to ancient Norse uh, details. Did a good job on that. Surprisingly, like I said in another episode, I've not yet seen a Viking game that, or a Viking themed game that actually respects the details as they were. It's usually more gimmicky. The whole thing with the uh, Vikings wearing horns, that, that, I assume people, most people know this, but yeah, that's, that's not real. Can we go already? <laughs> Fight's good. I'm glad I didn't opt to to downgrade his strength too much. Well, 
Just give me a second here. Sure you can handle carrying that? Don't want you to be lagging behind when we get attacked. Remain alert and quiet. I like the sound when you, when you run on the bridge. You've been standing here a while. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we got runes. It's obviously a, a combination code. It's not on that one. Oh man, which one contains that letter? Oh man, I went there. There, 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 there. Okay. So we got that. Okay. So it's gotta be this one. Yeah, yeah. Whew, that was a good puzzle. Scales, Walter. Maze here. So again, I was mucking about here a bit, messing about. Still trying to figure out how to get out of this place. What? Oh man. Oh, this is like a boss. Whoa. 
gotta get that blocking right. Gotta remember to, to press uh, <laughs> left bumper to, to fly. the wrong side? I... Let me guess. You're gonna be smug and say you told me we shouldn't get involved. That is enough. Can we go now? Do you remember the answer? Yeah, yeah. Boy, read this. Boy, what's that say? Only time you want to talk to me is when you need to. Do you want to tell me something? I said, the only time you care to talk to me is when you need me to translate for you. If mom was here- If your mother was still alive, we would not be here at all. Atreus. Forget it. Fine. Yeah, that whole dynamic between them is, is very interesting. I wonder why the, the developers made it that way. I feel like there is. It certainly pulls me in. What's going on? I get that he's a, you know, a hardened Viking that's grown up in a hard, in a harsh reality, and uh, you know must teach his uh, son that life is not a... <laughs> okay, so... Does that river go through there? It doesn't look like it, but then again it does look like you're supposed to... go that way. I suppose we're supposed to ditch the boat at some point. Because you can pick up new boats. Um, <laughs> this is just like boats all over the, over the world. I've heard of island societies that are like that with cars. They just ditch, ditch cars, take some off, someone else's car. And just, you know, you can take whoever's car you want. Yeah, these, so? These tiny island uh, societies. Who? You know. Oh, she was not there. Not like you would even care if she was. Mind your tongue, boy! Until our journey is over, one of us must remain focused. Do not mistake my silence for lack of grief. Mourn how you wish. Leave me to my own. I'm sorry. I didn't realize. No. Why would you? You do not know my ways. I know 
Tod has not been easy. In the light, I felt only moments pass. If that is of some comfort to you. That's good to know. Really. So, should we go back to Midgard? Face the Black Breath? Or do you think there's more to see in this realm? Okay. Well, I got several things on my mind. Sindri said mother was a warrior. Was she in a war too? Of a sort. Her family was decimated by hostile rivals, and she alone survived. She walked the warrior's path, but her war was to live on. To brave an unforgiving world alone. And that's why she has Sindri and Brock to make her the axe? She had the strength to wield such a weapon, and the wisdom to use it for good. She found purpose in protecting the weak. So, she'd help out the elves? No. See, okay, that, that explains the story. Can we pick another one of these two? Didn't see that way. Yeah, there's that place again that I wanted to get on. I see you've been busy. Our observant. Sindri. You boys look like you're gearing up for quite the journey. It's funny how they pop up everywhere. There's an abandoned temple in Midgard that a fellow dwarf converted to his personal storeroom. Packed it with all sorts of treasures he collected during his travels throughout the realms. Throughout the realms? Which ones did he go to? What did he collect? Fafnir was a, shall we say, aggressive collector of magical artifacts. The more he acquired, the more he desired. There was no realm too dangerous, no relic too hazardous. He once ventured deep into Niflheim for a whetstone of all things. Huh. I bet that was quite the whetstone. Does this story have a point? Yes, it does. I just happen to have an entry stone to Fafnir's storeroom. You might find something useful in there. Neat. Thanks, Sindri. You're very welcome. Oh, and uh, if you find that whetstone, well, it sure would be nice of you to bring it to me. Nice. I'd advise caution if you're heading to the storeroom. Last I was there, all manner of nastiness had taken up residence. Won't your friend be upset if we steal all the stuff? Oh, <laughs> no. No, not at all. He's dead. I think. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, no need to be sorry. These things happen when one travels from realm to realm collecting priceless artifacts that don't belong to you. To work we go. Yeah, so I wanna. I wanted to do some side questing and uh, upgrading here. So this looks good. No drawbacks. Fine piece of work. It, if I say so. Just, just pros. Myself. I don't like the look of it though. Myself. <laughs> I don't like the look of it though. This does look better, but. But. It's better. And I could do with some raising stats. Let's have a look around here. Because I have a bit of money, so... And after all that, I think it's fitting to upgrade some stuff. So this is the side quest here, and I definitely think we should go for it. But I also want to help some of the souls on the way. Uh, 
I have so many things I want to upgrade. Defense, but no luck, no. No luck, no chance. Definitely not drawing anything back to zero. Was there more to discuss? Be careful where you're going. There's nobody nice out here anymore since all the people left. I mean, I hate to generalize, but um, mostly they just try to kill you. Good tip. <laughs> All those voices in my head. Well, this wasn't the first time. Back when we met Brock, his animal warned me about something hiding in the trees. That's why she didn't want to cross. She told you. Well, I could just feel what she was feeling, what she was afraid of. Hmm. It happens again. You tell me. Understand? I promise. They certainly have an interesting story. It just cracks me up that they're still... Um, <laughs> this is all the adventure of scattering the ashes. Well, it's certainly a, an original take. Have the light to Midgard. Okay, so we have Alfheim and Midgard, and they look pretty similar. identical. It's crazy to think that all the realms exist in the same space, one on top of the other. It's like this room lets us travel without moving. Sort of mirror. Well, this is where we have both, both our side quests and main quests. Brock! We just came back from another realm. And we met your brother. Wait, not in that order. Did you let that seed saw put hand to your blade? Hmm? You do know he lost his talent, right? Just up and left him one day. Tried taking me down with him. Mm. Did he botch up on her girl? Quite the opposite. It looks beautiful now, though. Hmm. 
Yeah, even a blind pig farts up a truffle now and again. <laughs> but you know what really counts? Consistency. And I got that coming out of all of my parts. What did you do? It's better. Mark, it works. Good! Now when you're done gawking, I got a favor to ask. What is it, Dwarf? There's this alchemist on Vari. Been working out in the Velander mines. Haven't heard from him in maybe, I don't know, a hundred winters or so. Probably dead, but uh, maybe you can find him. He's dwarfing like me. Wears a fancy green ring. Owes me a favor. You look? If it is on our path. Oh, I see how it is. Not a something for nothing type, are you? Fine. If you find Don Vari, I'll make him whip you up something special. This entry stone here ought to get you inside those mines. Okay. I need that alchemist for something I'm stewing up for you. If in your smart, you'll find him. Come on in, then. So much for peace and quiet. All right. Should we upgrade more? There's new stuff here. Yeah, boy. Not enough. I you wish. What you want? I wish I would not have looked at that and kept it as uh, with a with the marker on it. Hmm. Yeah, we'll always need to have that. Yeah, just that's all the old stuff. Okay. Hope you got what you wanted. <laughs> See, it looks a little bit more balanced now. We're getting luck and vitality up a bit. And cool down, too. Hey, whatever helps, right? Yeah, I'm not going to hold on to the elven stuff. You take care now. Remember the way back to the Black Breath. We need to walk across the bridge to the Vanaheim Tower. Are we going to the Black Breath? Or exploring? Your choice. Oh, that's right. We have to go back to the Black Breath. Well, that's cool. Hope we meet the witch again. Look, we rode past that statue of Thor earlier, when we left the witch's cave. And what direction is that? Sun is over there, so that's south. Southwest? Good. Okay, that's that's good to know. That's westwards. I love that that uh Midgar snake serpent is just chilling out there in the background. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> you have potential, boy. Yeah. Yeah, he took care of the other guy. Shot him up while I ran by him to the next guy. Oh, 
actually nice to be back in Midgard. Alfheim was, uh, I wish it was a bit or more open world. Yeah. I didn't like the, I don't know, the boot screen, those evil boot screen, looking, knocking everything everywhere. And there wasn't much of an outdoors world. Gonna have a look around here. I'm keeping the the goal in mind, the compass, but I just wanna. Oh, those things are blocked by uh, spears. It looks like there's a there's a game here, a puzzle. What? Come on. Ah. Gaming. What? That should have worked. Oh. Yeah. Ah, of course, those things are blocking it. Those spears or whatever. Increased our maximum health. Nice. Oh, look at that. That's good. Okay, yeah, I've got a. Boats left. Correct. That ship again. Like a nice little pet, <laughs> the Migros. Yeah. Hey, Just a little find along the way here. Okay, we got another one of, the, one of these things. Okay. 
Oh, nice. But it's barely put it death to them. Oh my god. Just one hit? Oh man, I gotta load back up. Yeah, let's let's go to an earlier save. I want to avoid the the auto save and just go back to the manual save earlier. There, I think this is it. Yeah, yeah, it seems that way. Yeah, so we'll save that for later. That's for sure. Okay, so we have some souls here. I think I think those are the souls. Anyway, there's some stuff to, to find here. Some stuff, some stuff worth uh, investigating. Use my uh, my map use here. Want to have a look at this guy? What a what a nice picture. Okay, so it's not that way. Definitely got to remember this uh, place for later. Hey. So cool that he's moving. I see some loot up there. We can dock the boat here. Isle of Death. Okay, I hope this place is gonna be a bit easier. Hey, it's another brazier. I suppose you wish to light it. Can I? Vecchia. remember the last time I saw something walk these islands that wasn't dead or corrupted. What do you mean? The desolation, child. It plagues this land, growing more severe with each passing winter. Do you know its cause? Not for certain, but I suspect the appearance of the World Serpent, along with the great flood that followed. Many were drowned, myself among them. The dead began to walk not long after. Do you need anything from us? Boy. I only wish to speak to someone again. A wish you have just granted. Thank you. Okay. Checked off another one of those off the list.
Yeah, it's really worth it to to look around for things on your path to quests. Roy, what did I tell you about offering help? Don't. Correct. But can we this just... This is not a debate. You must learn focus. Our journey need be your only concern. But what if they can help us? That one seemed to know a little about the lake. And how does that help us with our goal? We won't know unless we ask. Starboard. The boat's right. Good. I do not know. Aren't you curious? Interesting. We go to the storeroom to collect anything useful for our journey. Not to learn more about the dwarf. Just make sure you watch each other's backs in the storeroom. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers. Let's do it. Yes, dear boy. I mean, that does look a lot nicer. What did we miss? Or, never mind then. Um, I know it's not my business, but if I were you, I'd wash off that symbol painted on your neck. We were told it would help protect us. Was that a lie? Oh, no, it's a protection stave, all right, but you can't render that pigment into paintable texture without blending it with boar urine. And is that really better than death? Maybe a little. Well, well it's your neck. <sighs> Oh! 
the soft steel. But we got the serpent skills. The soft steel isn't that useful to me anymore. Like I'm, I'm beyond, I'm, I'm beyond that. But this is all on the way to um, Brock's quest. Father, look up there. This uh, treasure in the in the in the cave or something. I think I can get all three from here. One, two, each side of the tree. Oh. And then. out of three. No, but it would be good to have a game that, What's that? that I play with the controller. Because it's not good for your health to sit, you know, with your wrist on the desk holding a mouse. And you, you know, we can get some real uh, issues from the, uh, beating your hands on the, on the desk all day. All day. <clears throat> Every once in a while, I'll feel, I'll feel um, um, feels like a little bit of a stinging sensation or a, a numbing sensation if I'm, if I'm at the desk for too long. So yeah, I really want to master this game. I w really want to learn to just focus playing it with the controller. Locked. Find another entrance. Plus it's more chill, you know. It's nice to lean back with the controller. I guess play the game the way it was meant to be played, really. Which reminds me, I should find more games that are like that. If anybody knows, can suggest good games that you can play on your PC, but that are well designed for controller playing, please comment below. I would love to get some ideas. Let me know what you would like to see. Whoa. Okay, so this is this is where the side quest is. This is where the we're supposed to find the thing. Boy. Another map. Great. So that seems to be the character that Brock talked about. Looks like the Reavers made it inside. I hope they didn't take all the so treasure. So once you're inside the quest, let me just save first. Here. Be on the safe side. Let's see what's in. Let's just see what's inside. Stupid 
good pots. Mm, and Drago. Yeah. No magical treasure. And no what? Yeah. Keep your expectations low, boy. And you will never be disappointed. That's true. That's actually a good philosophy. Okay. The entry stone. Trying to see if there really isn't anything else here. Because. I just want to read about the objective a bit. Now it just says it's inside this area. And I kind of just have to find it somehow. Uh, I'm not sure. Sure. I'm not sure if I really registered or understood what, what I'm really supposed to do here. To be honest, I, I forgot the, the backstory to this quest. Ready yourself! Get out! Yeah, me too. They caught you off guard. I wasn't expecting them. Exactly. What do you mean? He did great. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, Kratos. And isn't this a big circle, though? What well, was it? Some treasure in a cave? I feel like that's what... Here we go. The first room is open. Okay. So apparently, the quest consists of several uh, rooms or steps. I don't really know. I, I, I couldn't find it. any way to proceed. I can always come back to this, I suppose, but, but maybe it's out here? What you talked about, boy? <laughs> it's okay. It's like looking at the killed victims. Just want to see if there was something else up here. Because the boy did talk about something up there. place to to try to find the other rooms I don't want the side quest to be too long like if I'm not I can always save it from later like I said I'm gonna save that other fight I had for later but I guess I can try this again. Okay, so now the bridge. Alright. Okay, here we go. Okay, so that's how you get to the next room. Focus. Everything okay over there? Dude. 
Okay. Okay, that fight was... Sorry, guys. I think that's... I'm a bit in over my head there. Yeah, I don't want to waste the resurrection stone. It's better to load back. Yeah, sorry guys, I think I'm gonna save that fight for a little bit later. I think I'm almost there. I'm getting close to where I can beat that guy. Definitely compared to the guy that I found the uh, lake. He killed me with one hit. But yeah, the, the, that's a quest I'm going to have to save for later. And I do want to start checking out the main quest. Yeah, so I'm going to let you guys off the hook here, guys. It's been an awesome experience, um, and as you see, I've already recorded a lot more. Uh, there's a lot more going on, but in this uh, video project, but I'm heading towards the main quest, and I think I'm going to save that for the next video. Uh, this is around an hour and a half, and I think it's long enough. And stay so you know, just stay tuned. Um, the next video will be coming up in just a matter of hours, I think, uh, and it's going to be just as cinematic as this one. I can promise you that, if not more. It's the main quest. There is epic stuff going on. Um, but yeah, thanks for uh, watching. Please leave a like, please comment and share with your friends, your donkey, your uncle, your cat, the girl you have a crush on in school. Share with everybody around the world. Share the love and see you next time. Peace.